Hi, my name is Fabio Cavaliere, I work from Ericsson. I'm talking to you about the 5G cross-solve switch demonstrator uh, as a part of the 5-tonic uh, test bed. The demonstrator uh, operates according to the time deterministic framing protocol developed within the project to ensure uh, uh, maximum bandwidth efficiency and uh, minimum latency on uh, uh, time demanding frontal uh, signal. So, in the test bed, you uh, can see remote radio units. We have two remote radio units, two remote uh, nodes, and you can see also some uh, hub node, uh, one hub node for baseband uh, processing, and uh, switches are present at every node uh, to multiplex uh, Ethernet signals uh, that correspond to backhaul signals and the CIPRI signals that we use for frontal uh, purposes. The nodes are connected by a dense wavelength division multiplexing network. You can see here the fiber and uh, uh, each uh, 10 gigabit per second optical channel in the network multiplexes uh, two gigabit Ethernet channels and two 2.5 uh, CIPRI uh, signal. In the, uh, in the uh, test bed, uh, we have uh, these uh, switches that uh, uh, operates according to the multi-layer paradigms uh, developed within the 5G cross-all project. In this picture, you can clearly recognize the multi-layer structure of the switch. There is a first switch that operates according to uh, wavelength uh, cross-connection. There is a second layer that uh, operates at a time slot level and implements the deterministic uh, delay framing protocol uh, that was uh, studied and developed in the project. And finally, the uh, client and uh, Ethernet, uh, client Ethernet, a CIPRI signal that uh, have been demultiplexed are individually sent to a packet or Ethernet uh, switch and to uh, CIPRI uh, Max and the Maxis. You can see also in this picture how the framing protocol works. It is uh, synchronous to CIPRI frames, not to introduce additional jitter and latency on that time-sensitive client signal and uh, buffers uh, the Ethernet uh, signal, which is less time uh, demanding. Uh, in the setup, we used CIPRI uh, and uh, Ethernet, but uh, the same concept uh, can be easily expanded to accommodate uh, every new generation frontal interface uh, that will be developed within the 5G uh, environment, making the uh, testbed very future-proof. Thank you.